everybody. Welcome back to Yoga TX. Today we are filming in the lovely Dharma Yoga Guadalupe location right here in Austin, Texas. Uh, my name is Lauren and for today's video we're really going to explore our neck and our shoulders a little bit. Uh, this is kind of a follow-up video to the other yoga for neck pain video that I've done previously. Be sure to check that one out and come back here for some more stretches, a little bit of relieving some of that stress we hold in our upper bodies and our shoulders, kind of, you know, all that we get from hunching over our desks or our cars. Uh, so we're actually going to get started standing up today. So go ahead and spread your feet about hips distance apart, really just kind of rooting down into the toes, and then lift up gently through the knees and the thighs very lightly engaging the core, and then release the shoulders down and away from the ears, spinning the palms front. Feel free to close the eyes here for a moment, and maybe grow another inch through the spine, through the back of the neck, through the crown of the head. Really noticing if you're caving your chest forward, really opening up. We'll take five deep breaths here, just standing tall within ourselves, really spinning the palms and the heart open to new possibilities. Beginning to even out the length of each inhalation with the length of each exhalation, breathing in deeply through the nose. Taking one more big deep breath cycle just like this. And then gently blinking the eyes open. We'll inhale, lift the arms out and up to the sky, lifting the gaze slightly, palms touch. And exhale, the hands come to heart center, neck bows, head bows. We'll do this twice more, inhaling the arms up wide overhead, palms kiss at the top, and exhale. Draw the hands to heart center. Inhaling one more time up. And this time as we exhale, open the palms, open the arms, draw the elbows in towards each other, really opening the heart opening the shoulders, lift the gaze up slightly, and just take two breaths here, really getting into that space between the shoulder blades. Maybe feeling all that TV watching in our backs a little bit. And exhale, inhaling the arms back up. And exhale, hug the elbows in towards each other. Let's do this twice more, inhaling the arms up. And exhale, hug the elbows in, lifting the gaze slightly. Inhale the arms back up. And exhale, hands come to heart center. And here we'll shake out the hands for a minute, keeping the feet rooted, grounded, firm where they are. We'll go ahead and just take a few shoulder rolls here. First one direction, really rounding the spine, that upper spine, and then opening the heart. And then reverse the direction of those circles, maybe bringing the elbows into it a little bit not worrying about what you're looking like. And we'll start to come into the neck a little. We'll just take a few gentle rolls of the neck, starting to one side. If you drop the throat and you can't breathe and you feel constricted, back off a little bit. Keep it at an easy pace. A good rule of thumb is in yoga, if you can still breathe, you're probably doing it right. 
and take one more slow circle this direction, really trying to get into everything all along the sides and the back of the neck. And then we'll go ahead and reverse the direction of those circles, really trying to keep your shoulders open still. You can spin the palms forward if it helps to remind you. Remembering to breathe. Feeling free to rest the eyes closed if you'd like for this last circle. And just bringing the gaze back to neutral, head back to center. We'll go ahead and just drop the right ear to the right shoulder, stretching the side of the neck, sort of like we did in that last neck video. Pausing here for a moment, really rolling the heart open. And then play with shifting the gaze. So just point the nose down towards the right hand. And then coming back through that center, keeping that stretch in the left side of the neck, lift the gaze slightly up towards the ceiling. Let's do that once more either way, dropping the gaze towards the right fingers. <sighs> Moving slowly here, lifting the gaze towards the ceiling. Again, pausing where you can still breathe. Coming back to that center. We'll draw the head back to neutral. And just go ahead and drop the ear over to the other shoulder. Being mindful that we're not hunching down when we do this. Really opening up, really lengthening, really stretching through that side of the neck. Dropping the gaze, the nose towards the fingertips. And then inhaling it back through, lifting the gaze up to the ceiling. Just very gently awakening the neck, relieving some tension, dropping the nose back, and then lifting the gaze once more up to the ceiling. We'll go ahead and release it back to neutral, draw back to that center, maybe shake out the arms for a minute, shake out the legs for a minute, take a wiggle break. And then find your way back to that nice, grounded, rooted posture in the feet. And we'll move from there. So we're gonna shake the neck around a little bit. So first I'll demonstrate a little slowly and then we'll kind of get into it a little faster. Just be mindful that whatever speed you're going, however hard you're whipping your neck around, make sure that it still is releasing and feels good. You know, we're not trying to crick our neck or anything like that. So standing tall, we'll go ahead and turn the cheek to one side twice, and then turn it to that same side again. Lift the nose up to the ceiling, draw the gaze back across the shoulder, and center. We'll do that to the other side. Two quick shakes to one side, and then turning it to that side, lift the nose, drop it back, and return it to center. So now that you know the pattern, let's do that a few times a little faster. So shake, shake, shake it, yes. And back to center, to the other side. A few times to either side, maybe speeding up or slowing down, however you see fit. One more time to either side. Maybe feeling a little silly, getting a little and then come back to center. Maybe roll the shoulders around for a brief moment. Wiggle out the fingers. And then we'll inhale the arms, come up overhead. Gaze lifts. Go ahead and draw the palms to heart center. Coming back to that breath. Inhaling the arms up and over. Really releasing the shoulders away from the ears, lengthening through the neck. Being mindful that we're not sticking our ribs out and engaging. Exhale, draw the hands to heart center. And we'll inhale the arms up overhead, hugging the elbows in like we did earlier, Hug, continuing to draw those elbows towards each other. Let's interlace the fingers behind the back, right at the sacrum. You can start with the elbows bent, or you can start to straighten them out, 
rolling the heart open, lifting the gaze a little bit. Pausing for a few breaths here. And then releasing back to center. We'll do one more exercise here to really stretch out the neck. So inhale, the arms come up overhead, bending the knees as much as you'd like. Just go ahead and exhale forward into a forward fold, releasing the head here, being mindful that we're not holding it up, but really letting that go, letting that energy drain out. Maybe shake the head a little no and a little yes. And then we'll go ahead and interlace the hands right behind the base of the skull, just allowing the weight of the hands to draw the neck down a little, to hang the head heavy, to release here. Again, bend the knees as much as you'd like. We'll take two more breaths here. If this is too intense, you're welcome to drop the hands. Bending the knees actually helps stretch the back a little more than if they were straight. One more deep breath in. And deep breath out. And then releasing the fingers. Go ahead and bend the knees and just slowly curl up through the spine, hugging the belly in, vertebrae by vertebrae. Until you come all the way to the top, neck rolling through last, opening the shoulders once more. And we'll go ahead and draw the hands to the center of the heart. Thank you for sharing your practice with me today. Hopefully your neck feels a little more open, your heart feels a little more open, your shoulders feel a little less stressed. If you like the video, be sure to give us a thumbs up. Check out some of my other videos on my playlist. You can follow along with us on Facebook. And I hope to see you back here again soon. Namaste. All through the right pinky toe edge. Take one more deep breath in. And then exhale, hands come to the hips. Again, mindful that blanket is all the way off the mat. We'll just step the left toes in about a foot, squaring the hips. We'll inhale, the heart open, gaze lifts. And exhale as we tilt the pelvis, folding forward here.